I'm Tim Taylor. I'm the executive director of the Sacramento Clean Cities Coalition. I work trying to advance uh, low emission and zero emission technologies and fuels. That's one reason why it's so exciting to be here and see this technology in action, this one that Westport has brought to us. Hydrogen is a technology, it's a fuel that makes it possible for us to have very low emissions or even zero emission. And in fact, relative to climate change emissions, it can actually be negative if you're using renewable fuels, which is possible with hydrogen. So with hydrogen, you're combusting it with this technology as opposed to a fuel cell, but you're combusting it with the carbon that's in the atmosphere. So you pull a little bit of carbon out of the atmosphere, you combust it and the carbon goes back in the atmosphere. You're not adding new carbon and you're also reducing the hydrocarbons that you would be pulling up out of the ground with fossil fuels. So you have a much, much cleaner technology in terms of air emissions, as well as either nearly eliminate or completely eliminate climate change emissions. One of the things that makes this technology that Westport is introducing so unique is that it is a diesel cycle engine, which means it has the efficiency of a diesel engine. And because of that, it has the same attributes, the same horsepower and torque curves, but at significantly improved fuel economy relative to, say, a natural gas vehicle that is spark ignited. You're not trying to reinvent the entire supply chain of how heavy-duty vehicles function. You're using all of that 100 years of industrial development to give yourself that advantage as opposed to an entire radically different strategy or technology that has no built-up industrial base.